Hello guys. Hello. Depending on where you're watching me from, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. How are you doing today? I hope you're doing great because I'm so happy today. Today is beautiful. Today is beautiful. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. Yeah, it means beautiful. If you're just seeing me for the first time, please smash that subscribe button, like and follow so that anytime I upload a new video, you'll be notified. Guys, help me so that we can build this family. I'm here in Nigeria today. This is my spa. Sorry about the roof. We have issues of um, the decking soaked with rain water, but that's by the way, we're still here. Maybe, hopefully, very soon, we'll move to another place, a better place. Okay, so let's get into the video of today. Today, I want to do a mask, a lightning mask, which could get rid of hyperpigmentation. Consistent use, it could also get rid of sunburns, spots, it brightens the face too. So, we have this Indian healing clay. Can you see it? Indian healing clay. It's a very nice one. They said the deep pore cleansing. It's also good for pimples. Get rid of unclog the pores that causes pimples all those um, acne and stuff like that. You see, after the after effect of this, uh, you will love your skin. Smooth, get rid of all those oily, mede mede on your skin. So this Indian clay said, okay, you can actually also use this for your whole body. Facials, okay, feel your face pulsate. That's what it says. Facial and body wrap, clay bath, foot soap, chill clay for knee pad. And insect bites, my dear, a lot. You can use this Indian healing clay for a lot of things. Okay, a lot of things. Ah, it's always very rare. Oh, in short, very scarce to get this. Before I could get this, and it's so expensive right now because of all these things post COVID, um, whatever. It's making laying your hands on most of these things very difficult but i was able to get this i use it on my client so today i want to show you using just this some natural ingredient this is natural though they put in some is it bento sorry bentonite clay. <laughs> sorry sorry should i check the ingredients okay it said oh 100 calcium natural Ben tonight, uh, girl. Well, as the ingredients here, yes, that's the ingredients in clay here. So that's my first first ingredient. Then we also have what I'm going to use is ground turmeric. Sorry, I have to make use of this. Then I'm going to use my rose water, but this one is rose water and glycerin. There are other recipes, but this is the one I'm going to use because I don't have pimples. My face is clear. My face is clear. Just want to brighten it a bit. So let's get down to this video. It's not difficult. You can get glowing, flawless skin with just little ingredients in your house, in your kitchen, or you visit a spa if you have the money. But if you don't have the money, just we can. Place your hands on this. Turmeric can get it anywhere. Rose water you can get it anywhere. We can achieve this. It's mostly used. I use it mostly for people that have all these large pores, pimples, acne spots. Mm -hmm. But not this particular recipe. This recipe is just for a glowing look. You understand? Just to make get my face glowing. It's not for the pimples, but it still helps. Helps with hyperpigmentation. It also reduces redness on the face. These ones are mild. I'm not going to use lemon. There are other things you could use, but this this recipe. Maybe in another video, I'll give you a recipe for pimples, pimples, acne mask. You understand? Still using this, but with other ingredients that targets those issues. So first of all, I'm going to opening it sorry i have to use gloves because 
you know, turmeric stains, and I don't want it to stain my nails. So, sorry, sometimes I have to look for because in case a client walks in. <laughs> okay, so this is partly open. I want to put. I have to open it up a bit. Then, since I'm just using my face on my face, I'll just take this spoon I'm using. This spoon. Try not to allow water to enter. I'm just going to use a little because it's just for my face. Okay. And just remember, always sanitize all your equipment, all your plates, your spoons. This is my sanitizer. I made it myself. I like doing things on my own instead of spending lots of money to buy. I can do all those things. So that's the... Oh, sorry. That's the... Indian healing cure. Then my turmeric. Okay. Uh, open it and just take just pinch. Not much because I don't want it to stain me. Sorry. You might be sorry about the background noise. This place is a very busy area. So it's just like that should be one quarter. Mm -hmm. That's one eight F. I don't need much on my face. I don't need much. I'm just putting this because it actually stains, but it's really good for the skin, spots and stuff. Then I'm going to use this glycerin and rose water. Glycerin, okay. Here it says soothing emollient solution for daily use. You can actually use this as a cleanser. So I'm going to use just that. I don't want to use so many ingredients, so. Put in two spoons and then I'm mixing it. Sorry, I'm sorry about that. So I'm mixing it up, mixing it up. See how it turns. You can still put your turmeric if you like here, but see how it turned out. I don't want to put so much, I don't want that yellowish stain on my face. So you mix it up very well. Hmm, strong. It's good. Sorry. Okay, then this is my. You can use your hand, but I want to use it because it's going to stain. Since I didn't put much turmeric, it's not safe. See how it is? My face, I've already cleaned my face. I'm not using any makeup. We all know the benefits of turmeric on our skin. It helps with sunburn, hyperpigmentation, spots, gives you a flawless look. Please remember to always avoid your eye area. Avoid your eye area because that place is very sensitive. You don't want your face to be red as a result of this, but it's actually so calming, so good. This I'm going to use it for 10 minutes. I'm going to use it for 10 minutes. Or till it dries on my face, then I'll wash it off and then you have you're going to have flawless glowing you see my skin will be lighter see how the mask is i try to avoid this my eye area sorry about that my i have apprentices here people that are learning from me they the ones making that noise the outside i had to Tell them to excuse me because I didn't mute them right. And the distraction. If you can actually hear what they are saying, that's Ibibio. Is it Ibibio? Ibibio Anna, yeah. I'm actually from a Caribbean. So you can actually hear the language. You're speaking the language. If you want me to teach you the language, you can. <laughs> Holler at me. That's what I do in my spa. I do facials for people. Those that want the natural ingredients, I also use it. Most of the ingredients I use are 
natural, but I still have to impute some of these other ones. Other ones I buy, the products I buy, which are not harmful to the skin. Like this one is so nice. Let's see what I'm doing because I don't want it to stain. Turmeric stains a lot. See, I don't really have um much issues with my skin. This um, sorry, I'm sorry. this um. Indian healing clay. I'm feeling this bit of it's not irritation, it's kind of minty, has this kind of minty feel. No mint now. Or mint, yeah, mint, peppermint, you know. You take it to your nose, you know that feel. That's how I feel. It's not kind of irritating my body. I feel that minty, it has this minty feel on my skin. You see, I'm gonna wash it off. All those black, those that have black lips, and also, no, not on your lips, but no, I would have relaxed that here. So, guys, that's it. I don't want to put it here because you know, I don't want it to stain me. If I were in the the main spa area, I would have done it. I have to pull my clothes or just shoot it out a bit. But I don't want to do that because I'm in the main area and inclined to walk in. Okay, so I'll leave that to get dry or just give it 10 minutes. Then I wash off. You see, by the time it's dry, I can use my hand and rub on it and it will be dropping. Dry, dry, you know, stuff like that. But the best thing for me to do is to wash it off. If you use a face cloth, yeah, face towel. You use it, it might stain because of the turmeric. Turmeric stains and you might have either you condemn it or use it like but just know it's going to change the color of the material you're using. So with this, you get a flawless, clean, beautiful, and light skin. So, guys, I think I'll wait. If I want to sit here and wait, the video will be so long. So what I'm going to do is I'll go wash it off. I'm going to show you a picture of how my face turned out. So guys, thank you for watching me. Watch out for my next video. If you have any questions, please drop it on the comment section. Or if you want to reach out to me, my WhatsApp number is also there. Please do well to subscribe, like, and share support me support you thank you very much see you on my next video